Piers Morgan, this one's for you. You said women want to become Muslim so they can't be oppressed. So many women become Muslim these days. Mm. Why do they so want to be oppressed? Is that what you're going to tell me? No, no. Why, why do so many Muslims want to be oppressed? Women in the world. Wow. You're not just an Islamophobe. You are an uneducated Islamophobe. And it kind of makes me laugh. Someone in your position should maybe speak with a real Muslim and see what this represents. You think this is a sign of my oppression? This is a sign of my liberation from guidelines that have been set by you and your likes to objectify all women, to make us a thing to please you, to please your desires, to fulfill the desires of your eyes for you to gaze upon. But I am so much more than that. I am so much more precious than that. I'm not here in this world to please you or any other man. I'm here in this world to please my creator and your creator too, by the way. This is a sign of my submission to my creator, not to any human being or to any man-made rule. And it bothers you because you don't know what goes under this. Let me tell you as a Muslim woman what is under this. Under this is a heart and a mind of a believing woman, of a woman who can reject everything and say no. This does not fit what God has asked me to do. Underneath this is a heart and mind of a successful woman who speaks three languages, has a bachelor's degree, is a mom, a sister, a wife, a daughter, an aunt, a community member, a public speaker who's been around all the world. But I refuse to abide by your guidelines. The only one I bow down to is not any man on this earth except my creator, God. This is a sign of my liberation of you and your lives. It's not a sign of my oppression. And if there's anyone who's oppressed is a mind like yours, I'm so sad to say. Go and get educated. And sisters, you watched my video. Share yours.